How hard can it be to catch a first stage booster with a helicopter? Come on, we're right there. We're right there. Just need to get a little closer and we got this. It's not rocket science. This is Echo 3 and let's discuss the Electron made by Rocket Lab. The Electron is a 1.2 meter wide, 18 meter tall, two stage to orbit rocket. It uses a unique electric pump fed engine called the Rutherford. The first stage uses nine engines and the upper stage uses a single vacuum optimized Rutherford. The engines use RP1 and liquid oxygen. For my version of the rocket in the game, I'm using the Spark engine and the 1.25 meter parts. The Spark engine produces just slightly less thrust than the Rutherford, but its specific impulse is considerably less. Another unique design decision for the Electron is its heavy use of carbon composite materials and 3D printed parts. The carbon composites help keep weight down, while the 3D printed parts help with reducing costs. And new this week, Rocket Lab is aiming to recover its first stage booster by catching it with a helicopter. The goal being to be able to reuse the first stage similar to SpaceX. The Electron is one of the newer rockets on the market. On the 21st of January 2018, on just the second launch of an Electron, it was able to achieve orbit. The mission was named Still Testing. The following launch launch, its business time was its first successful contract mission. Initially, Rocket Lab founder and CEO Peter Beck was not interested in making Electron reusable, but later he had to figuratively eat his words and literally eat his hat. On just the 10th launch, named Running Out of Fingers, the company added some new thermal insulation and sensors to test the feasibility of recovering the booster. In March of 2020, Rocket Lab conducted low altitude parachute tests. On one of these, a booster was dropped by one helicopter. A second helicopter, fitted with a long boom, was able to catch a drogue line on the booster and transport it back to land. On the 20th of November, 2020, on Rocket Lab's 16th launch, the booster stage made a parachute landing in the ocean. The booster was then recovered and examined. This mission was named Return to Sender. Now for a mission named by some J.R.R. Tolkien fan, there and back again. This mission aims to place 34 satellites into a sun-synchronous orbit, and if all goes well, the booster will safely descend through the atmosphere and deploy a parachute. After the parachute deploys, it should decelerate to around 10 meters per second. If all goes according to plan, this will enable a very skilled helicopter pilot to capture the booster and safely put it down on a recovery ship. I too shall attempt to capture a falling booster. Unfortunately, this footage is not the same as my launch footage. I had a helicopter stage that I was intending to try and catch that booster with. However, the Kraken didn't seem to like it and kept eating my helicopter. It was staged next to the runway and when I tried to switch back to the helicopter, it would clip through the ground and get destroyed. So this is a separate attempt, but I did launch this booster section up and I am trying to catch it and I don't know if having the helicopter staged on the building help with the cracking issues or not but we are going to try and capture this booster with a helicopter rather than a long boom I have a piston with one of the grabbing units on it and I'm hoping I can somehow make contact and capture this booster now my booster I have three pillar shoots on there so it would slow down to around six six and a half meters per second as opposed to with just two parachutes it'd be around 10 meters per second but this is really tricky to get done and I could see maybe with that drogue line, it would help than trying to use just this little grabbing unit that I have on there. But if I take my time, I might actually be able to do this. Let's line up. Careful. Oh, that was, this is really close this time. Not, not quite, but I think, I think I'm definitely getting closer. I've got to watch my target marker and my prograde marker there on my nav ball. And I think we might be able to make this happen. We're coming around. We're going to come up. This is, we're really steady on it this time. We might be able to get it looking good good looking good we are lining up well that prograde marker is right there on the target marker I think we're going to make contact we're going to do this we are going to do this and we are we're hooked I, I think it's just on the landing strut but that counts I have hooked a booster with my helicopter I am Echo 3 and thanks for joining me on this discussion about the Electron rocket I will see you next time